Your local network consists of the devices you have connected to your router. This might include your Vertex recorder, your computer, your laptop, and your printer. In order to access your recorder from a location outside of your local network using the internet, you will need to configure your router to forward the information from the internet to your recorder. This video will provide step-by-step -step instructions for configuring port forwarding on your HDIP recorder. Before we begin, you will need to install and turn on your HDIP recorder with a monitor attached and a network connection. First, you must configure your router. The following instructions are generic. If you are not familiar with this process, you should consult the user manual of your router. Other helpful resources are the manufacturer website, support line, or a website such as portforward.com. Connect to the router through the router interface. Typically, this is through a web interface. Log in to the router with an administrative ID. Access the port forwarding section in the router. Some may list this as port triggering, pinhole, firewall forwarding, or other terms. The port of the HDIP recorder will need to be forwarded to the internal IP address of the recorder. The default port for the HDIP system is 80. Once the router has been configured, we are now ready to configure port forwarding on the HDIP recorder. Make sure the recorder is connected and turned on. We will first need to switch your recorder to advanced setup mode. To do this, right-click the live screen and click Menu. In the main menu, click System. Select Basic Advanced Setup Mode and click Advanced. Once this is completed, click Network and then click Web Port. Verify that the port designated on your recorder is the same as the port you have chosen on your router. The default port is 80. To change the web port, click NUM and type your desired port number. This number must be the same as the port configured on your router for remote access to function. Click OK to save your changes. Right-click to return to the main menu, and right-click again to return to the live screen. Your recorder and your router are now configured for port forwarding. For more information on how to access your recorder using the internet, please see the user manual or the remote access quick start guide included in the packaging for your recorder. If you have questions or run into problems, please use the support section of the website or call for technical support at 1-855-2AVERTX.